Welcome to Science 4 for Quarter 2, Week 5, Module 12, Effects of the Environment on the Life Cycle of Organism. The most essential learning competency for this Module 12 is to describe the effect of the environment on the life cycle of organism. Specifically, one, define pollution. Two, identify the different types of pollution. Three, explain the effects of environmental changes in the living thing. Class, before we start with our new lesson, let us have some review. Are you ready? Animal transformation. Direction, arrange the stages of the life cycle of the animals. Number it on the following box below. Are you ready? Timer starts now. Nice work! Your answer is correct! Now class, how does an environment affect an organism? Let us find out. The environment consists of two parts. We have the biotic environment, which means living things. Abiotic environment, these are non-living things. Biotic factors is a living organism that shapes its environment. The examples of biotic factors are plants, animals, fungi, and bacteria. Abiotic factors is a non-living part of an ecosystem that shapes its environment. The examples of abiotic factors are water, sunlight, soil, air, and temperature. They both can affect the growth of an organism. Living things continue to exist as they use and interact with the environment. Humans have created undesirable effects on the environment. Humans' abusive activity bring harm, leading to the destruction of the environment by decreasing water, air, and soil resources. The ruining of habitat, even in the destruction of ecosystems, the death of wildlife, and pollution. One of the biggest threats considered that the world is facing today is pollution in the environment. Overpopulation of human and advancement in different areas have used up natural resources that eventually causes air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution, and deforestation. Pollutions greatly affect the environment and all living organisms. Pollution is the introduction of contaminants into the natural environment that cause adverse change. There are different types of pollution. 1. Air pollution 2. Land and soil pollution 3. Water pollution 4. Noise and light pollution Air pollution 
the harmful particles in the air, either speck or invisible, cause health hazards to all living organisms, such as people, animals, or plants. Air pollution come in various forms and may include several different toxins and pollutants in virus combinations. Examples of air pollution aerosol sprays to kill pests like mosquito and cockroach. Water pollution it occurs when harmful elements, often chemicals or microorganisms, contaminate a stream, river, lake, ocean, or other body of water, downgrading the water quality and dispensing toxic to humans or the environment. Example of water pollution Chemicals coming from factories and house waste from residential areas The third kind of pollution is land and soil pollution It is the accumulation of solid or liquid matter on land or underground that can pollute the soil And ground water place public health at risk and cause problems and unsightly situation. Example, garbage thrown carelessly anywhere. Fourth type of pollution is noise and light pollution. These two kinds of pollution, noise and light pollution, can cause severe destruction to humans and the environment. This may further progress in areas with sufficient natural spaces. Light pollution is more alarming. However, in urban areas where extreme noise is common, Noise pollution poses an immense danger. Example of noise and light pollution. High sounding noise of airplane. Too much use of LED lights. The types of light pollution are glare, sky glow, light trespass, and over lighting. Pollution affects living things in many ways. The decline in the reproduction of trees and crops can cause a scarcity of food and oxygen for humans and animals. Reduction in the supply of safe and clean drinking water for humans and animals. Unpredictably weather patterns cause disturbances in the reproductive periods of animals and plants. It causes respiratory diseases in humans like asthma and lung cancer. Decreases the propagation of animals and plants in aquatic habitats. Decreases the supply of safe drinking water for humans and animals. It causes climate change and global warming that may affect living things. Increase rapid climb in the population of disastrous insects that breed in a populated environment. Contaminates the habitat where organisms grow and develop. It alters the good timing of migration, mating, and blooming of living things. Hinders usual pattern or behaviors and eating cycles, 
causing a shrinking in wildlife populations. Class, remember the following. Environment consists of two parts, the biotic and abiotic environment. Humans have caused bad effects upon natural environments. Life cycle of the living things in the environment can be destroyed through pollution. Pollution is an action that making the environment become dirty and unsafe. Now class, after learning the different types of pollution and the effects of environmental changes on the living things, let's have your learning activity. Are you ready? Direction. How do changes in the environment affect the stages in the life cycle of living things? Look at the labeled picture and complete the chart below.